In this video, I will present how to solve most common issues related to crashes of Skyrim Special Edition. Here you can see some tips, how to properly install mods and how to avoid problems with them. First of all, I recommend to use Mod Organizer to easily install and remove mods if needed. Worth to mention, you should not remove mods in mid-play through. Some mods need to be installed by manual placing in data folder. In main Skyrim game folder, Mod Organizer offers an option to sort mods via loot. It helps to keep mods in correct order during game load. There are two mods I would recommend you to install, SSE Engine Fixes and Skyrim Display Tweaks. In SSE Engine Fixes, you should modify some options to avoid game crashes in the future. Follow these steps. Set Max Studio to 2 or 8 MB. That may prevent from save load crashing. Avoid quick saves if you have multiple mods. With this option, you can press F5 to create regular saves quickly. Set save max size as true. This can prevent from crashing if your save reaches more than 64 MB. It may happen when you have many mods and played for hours. As you can see here, the more you play, the more MB of save file you will have. You can reduce save file size by selling unnecessary in-game items. You can also use Resaver tool, that I will present you later. If you are facing crashes despite proper mods installation, you should also add Crash Logger to your mod manager. This tool will generate a crash log, every time the game closes unexpectedly. You can try to locate the cause of crash by yourself but I would also recommend to use Online Crash Log Analyzer. Online Analyzer will provide necessary information about the crash. It may also provide some tips and solutions how to solve the problem. In 99%, the crash is caused by outdated, badly written mods. It may also be caused by mods that have minor overlaps with the same files. The best way to check if a specific mod is causing a crash is by disabling it. If you want to remove mod from your game for good, the Resaver tool may be helpful. This tool can also solve problems with loading the game save. Select the save game file from your list and open it in Resaver. Here you can safely use these options, remove unattached instances and undefined elements. Those items comes from old mods and unused in game scripts. Additionally, I used Reset Havoc options to solve issues related with in-game objects. It may also help you to reduce the size of your save game file. Here you have an example of corrupted save file. The game was saved with removed mods. By removing unnecessary instances, I was able to resolve all problems with crashing of the game. Do not forget to do backups of your save files. Just in case, some new mod lead to a problems with the game. Thank you for attention. 